Your kids are getting brainwashed with political propaganda at school. Here are a few examples. In Florida, public school officials recently approved the use of educational videos that literally compare climate activists to Nazis and claim that climate change is natural. These videos were made by PragerU, a conservative group that has received millions in funding from fracking billionaire brothers Ferris and Dan Wilkes. In Oklahoma, public school teachers are provided classroom materials by the industry-funded Oklahoma Energy Resources Board. Their Petro Pete mascot teaches kids that without fossil fuels, they wouldn't even have ice cream. He says, having no petroleum is like a nightmare. Is the climate crisis a nightmare? That is unclear, and it's certainly not taught. In Ohio, the industry-funded Ohio Natural Energy Institute provides instructional materials like a worksheet on the environmental benefits of crude oil and gas, a crude oil word find, and an activity place map for schools. Hooray. Also across the country, teachers are using lesson plans from the National Energy Education Development Project, which is sponsored by every major US-based oil and gas company and oil industry trade group. These lesson plans not only teach kids how to frack a frozen layer cake, they provide industry-funded climate change lessons, which teach kids things like the climate has always changed and that humans will simply adapt to the outcome. Easy for the oil and gas industry to say, they've got billions of dollars. But yeah, I guess books with same-sex parents in them are the real threat to our children, not the oil-funded lesson plans that teach them that the climate crisis is fake. Got it. Cool. Awesome. Love it here.